No, you are welcome. Thank you. How are you guys doing? We are doing great. I hope you are liking the place. Mm, yes, it's a very really nice place. Wow. <laughs> okay, meet Mr. Casey. Mm, you are welcome, sir. Thank you. You guys are amazing. Mom, yes. Please, who is he? Oh, okay. This is your new guy. The one I told you that. He's an amazing man and he's going to make you guys happy. <laughs> We were really expecting it. Thank you. Okay. Okay, thanks. I'll be inside, okay? Oh, then let's follow you then. All right. You guys are amazing. Find any food in the kitchen. So, what should I do? There is nothing I can do right now. Mommy, I'm hungry. Look, you are the cause of everything. You've caused it. If you were not to be extra hard on our sister's kids, at least even when they are gone, we could be sending us money. Now you're blaming me. Now it's all my fault, right? Mama, you have to do something now. See, there is nothing I can do right now. Don't add problem to my problem. I'm thinking about something. You see, those days, uh, sister hate to hear that you are sick. And those was the times that she, she'll be sending money like she's mad. Hmm. I think Mika is making sense here. How? Yes. Do you know what? Let's call her with a different line. Then we tell her if you are sick. In fact, you are even admitted at the hospital. Yes, Mama. That is the point. I think we will do that. No, you will go no. What plan, Mama? Your words are smart, Mama. Yes. Mama. Mama, you have to do something. You must do my car. I can't stay more than an hour. I, I have a friend. And I think we should use that phone. Mm -hmm. By yourselves? Mother took us. Wow. Dad. Yes. Please, are you going to be here with us forever? Mm. Very soon, I will. But I have other things to take care of with my mother. So I will go and come back tomorrow. Is your mother a grandmother? Of course, yes. Is she a bad grandmother? She's a very loving grandmother. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Dad. We can't wait to meet him. You will meet him again. Yeah. Come here. Sweetheart. Hi. I'm ready to go. So soon. Yeah. Meanwhile, there is something I want to put before you. Um, I want us to visit your country Ghana in appropriate time. Okay. Is there a problem? You don't seem to be okay. I had a call. My mom is not coming. Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. So what are you doing about it? Mm -hmm. I want to send them some money for their own kids and then help you also. Please do. Meanwhile, we have to be praying for them as well. Thank Come you. here. Come here. Love you, babe. Love you too. No, I don't want anything to happen to you. Mm -hmm. Be safe for me. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Be strong. Mm -hmm. 
The mom will be fine, okay? Yeah. Let me go and come. Alright. Okay. Yeah. I think since a girl is just for marriage and is to spend all her time in the kitchen. Marina! What do you got all those useless ideology for? I hope it's no grandma always telling you all those. She also said as a girl child, for that matter, me, I am for another man. And any resource or time spent on me is a waste. My daughter, it is never true. It is not true. I am who I am today, not because I didn't listen to their stupid thoughts. But I make focus. I believe in myself. That is why I made all these things. Hmm? Your grandma, my mom, gave birth to me at the age of 20. That girl's a strong woman. If you take a very good look at her, you realize that nothing will her down. Well, that's true. But she remains one of those girls who will definitely walk away one day. Hmm. You know something? Like, she doesn't believe in gender inequality. Let's support her. You finish helping your five girls, you can do more for them if you have the means to. Besides, they are all girls, and then they are all growing up, and one day they will become who they want to become. For me, I have done a five years investment, so count me out. I don't have anything to spare. Hey, hey, Mama Fia. Anyway, I will look in the approval, so since you are in agreement, I hope that Sure, you can go ahead. Besides, she is my daughter and I love her. Else, I wouldn't go to bring her to live with us. Okay, alright, alright. Let's end it then. Yeah! <laughs> What's that? Papa! Now. But you see, I'm working. You know what? Just give me 30 minutes and I'll be done with this. And then, you know. This is the... Look at you. <laughs> What's it tonight? 30 minutes. <laughs> Yes, Father. Remember to serve you, Mother Gana, well. Yes, Father. To serve you with integrity, okay? Yes, Father. Where is Janet? She will soon come. I told her you want to see her. Oh, okay. Here she is. Father, please, what is it? Me, what is it? Will you straighten your face and let me talk to you? Janet, it's about time you took your life serious. I've spoken to you several times on your career, what to choose and what to decide and what to do in life. Are you still on, are you still bent on taking, uh, is it, what do you call it, being a petition? 
Father, please, I'll think of it. Sister here now is, is a police officer. It's not a CID. Congratulations, sis. Thank you, Janet. But I wish you listened to what Father is saying. I'll be very happy to see you becoming a doctor. I mean, I beg you. Thank you.